back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can tell in the title of this video, it's not a surprise to you that my dog is going to do my makeup today. Well, as you can tell, he's laying right here. He's a little camera shy. Say hello. <gasps> he don't really like seeing himself in the camera. I don't know why. But um, other than that, I hope you all really enjoy this video. I hope you stay until the end and see what my beautiful baby decides that my face needs to look like today. And um, if you like it, please give it a massive thumbs up. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. I hope you decide to stay a while. Hit that subscribe button down below if you haven't already. And there is a bell right next to it. If you haven't hit that, it notifies you every time that I post a video onto my channel. And without further ado, let's see if this sweet baby can get my face looking good. Okay, so I'm just gonna have to tilt the camera down to him because he is being lazy. But the I'm gonna go ahead and let you know like the options and then we'll let him decide which ones he wants me to put on my face. <laughs> so the first option I am going to give him is the Max Prep and Prime Skin Base Massage. Probably said that wrong. And then the next one is the Bare Minerals Blemish Rescue. This is the Skin Clearing Anti-Redness Mattifying Primer. So do you want my face to be matte or do you want it to be not matte, I guess? All right, which one? You want this one? Not this one? You want this one? Okay. Okay, so it looks like he chose the Max Prep and Prime. So I'm just going to put some on my face. Okay, so it's gone a little better than I thought it would, but we've only got one product done. <laughs> I can't. All right, so now I am going to let him choose my foundation, but then I also am gonna let him choose between a beauty blender or a foundation brush. I never use a foundation brush for my foundation, so if he chooses that, this should be interesting. All right, so we are gonna have him choose between the Maybelline New York up to 24 hour foundation in the shade 112, which is natural ivory. This is a super stay foundation in its full coverage. And then I do believe this one is medium coverage and this is the Wet n Wild Soft Beige Photo Focus Foundation. Um, I do believe they are both cruelty free. So, no animals was harmed in the making of these two. All right, which one? You gotta choose, <laughs> quit being lazy. Which one? Which one? Okay, so uh, I had to go get the dog treats Mainly because this is all he's wanting to do. So, what I'm going to do is put the same treat in the hand with this. And whichever one he chooses, that is the one I will be using. He's just not having it today. So, let's see. Your same treat. So, let's see. All right, Drake. Which one? Ooh, yeah. I think that's only because that one was the closest, but we are gonna go with the Maybelline 24 hour foundation. Okay, so now Drake is going to choose between the Beauty Blender, which is really dirty, it needs to be clean, and the foundation brush. So I have little graham crackers with each, and we're gonna see which one he wants. All right, Drake, next. Ooh, beauty blender. Good boy. He knows his mama. I, mama, mama, pick that up. Thanks. I, I got it. He knows his mama a little too well. That's just being extra. Okay, so I'm just going to, I know he didn't choose this, but I'm just going to wet the beauty blender a little bit because I didn't go wet it beforehand. Honestly, figured he would choose the heat brush, but he actually went with the decision that I usually choose. So, we are going to apply this foundation and then let him choose the concealer. Okay. 
Okay, so the next step is concealer and we are gonna let Drake choose between my new handy dandy, the my favorite concealer so far that I've used. <sighs> I love it, is the Tarte Shape Tape and this is in the shade Fair. And I was gonna see, um, this one is cruelty free too, but I do believe. And then we are gonna let him choose that or the Wet n Wild Photo Focus um, concealer in the shade La Ivory. And this is also cruelty free. So let me get the traits and let's let him decide. All right, Drake. So we have Tarte Shape Tape or Wet n Wild. You want Wet n Wild? Oh, okay. It's not the one I wanted to go with. But this is his video, not mine. So we are going to conceal with the tart, the, the wet and wild. All right, I'm sure this is. Okay, so now that we have our concealer on, we are going to do bronzer. The problem is, is I only have one bronzer. So, he just has to go with this one. I mean, I don't have another bronzer. So, I'm just going to apply the bronzer. And this is the Bare Minerals, um... Ready. The Bare Minerals Ready Touch Up Veil in the shade tinted. And I'm just gonna put my bronzer on and I will let him choose cotton tour. Okay, so the next step is the contour. So he's gonna be choosing between the LA Killers Highlight Contour and Blush Palette and the Wet n Wild Dual Ended Contour Stick. Which one? Which one? Which one? You gotta choose. I know it's a hard choice. Choose. Um, uh, Do I need to bring them closer to you? Okay, we're going with this one. There's that. Thank you. Excuse his smacking. So he chose the Wet n Wild Dual Ended Contour Stick. And apparently that was a hard, hard choice for him. Okay, so... Now that we have all the contour done. Yeah. I don't really like that contour stick as much because I like powder, but that's what my baby boy cho chose. That's what mama's gonna do. So the next thing we're choosing from, which I'm a little skeptical about, but the next thing we're choosing from is powder just to set everything into place. And then we will bake. I hope he chooses the right baking powder. Who knows? So we're about to choose, through, choose setting powders. So the first one is the Revlon Color Stay Translucent Pow Setting Powder. And the other one is the LA Colors Setting Powder. And this is in the shade Beige. So let's let him choose and see which one he wants. I hope he knows Mama's taste better than I think he does. Gotta find two of the same cookie. All right, which one? Which one? Which one? Look, treat, treat. 
Which one? Oh, hard choice. Okay. Good boy. All right, so he chose the Revlon Color Stay Powder. My boy knows his mama very well. So we're just going to dab this into the skin and I'll be back for him to choose the baking powder. Okay, so this is where it can all turn south or it can go up from here. So, um, I'm gonna have him choose the baking powder. So I have the choice between the banana setting powder, which is yellow, or the e.l.f. sheer powder, which is translucent. Let's see if he knows which one to choose. All right, Drake. E.l.f. banana powder. Which one? Okay, and this is where the video goes south. Right here. I have never used this powder. <laughs> As baking powder. <laughs> but we're going to do it today. Oh, are you sure? Yeah? Okay. How oh, wonderful. Wonderful. Drake, I, honestly, I don't think this is going to brighten my face any. You don't want to hear it. And I can't just do some parts. I have to do everything <laughs> that I normally do. Honestly, son, I don't think this is going to help mama, but thanks for... Trying. Okay, well, we set this face and we're baking some banana pudding for about 450 degrees. Let's hope it brightens a little bit. Did you just huff? Did I hurt your feelings? I'm so sorry. I love you. Okay, so now we're going to be choosing between Target eyeshadow which is the the pro the pro fusion cosmetics and this is the sienna i probably said that so wrong um this is a 21 shade palette or the what was that okay Or the James Charles X Morphe palette. See in Target? Morphe. Let's see what my baby thinks. Alright, Drake. So we have Target Morphe. This is James Charles. This is I don't know the name. Which one? Which one? You have to choose. Treat. There's treats on both of them. See? Treat, treat. Okay, you want James Charles? That's a good boy. I do love this palette too though. So if you are looking for a good um, palette that is like drugstore brand, this one's wonderful. It blends beautifully. It's pretty good. But my boy knows his mama. And we are going to use the same concealer that he chose earlier to prime the lids. And then we're going to do an eyeshadow look. And I'll be back as soon as that's done.
Okay, so now that I have my eyeshadow done, I am going to wipe away <laughs> what was baking, which okay, we didn't bake, we darkened. That's okay. It's his preference. Whatever. It's what he wanted. Oh my God, this made my face look. No. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy, but I cannot add this to my normal everyday routine. It's just not gonna happen. So the next thing we're going to do is a brow. So I have the Unbeliever Brow by L'Oreal Paris. And this is in the shade Light Brunette. And then I have the Clinique Insta Fit for Brows Crayon and Highlight. And this is in the shade Soft Brown. So let's see which one he wants me to use today. All right, so L'Oreal. Or Clinique. Which one? Oh. Okay. No, you can't have that one too. We can't choose both. All right. Well, thanks. So we are going to be using the Clinique. It's my turn. I don't have another treat. Hey, excuse me. Can I? Can I do my eyebrows now? Yeah. Okay. He got mad. I will. Okay, now that the brows are done, we are going to choose, what's the next step? Eyeliner. Okay, sorry, I don't know why. It's okay, I didn't want you right now anyways. So, the choice between eyeliner is the Saadi, something like that. Um, starstruck. So the thing about this one is if I have to use this one, I know they're both black and I know they're both liners, but if I use this one, I have to use the star stamp that's on the other side as well as the other side. And this one is just a plain liner. So let's see which one he wants. This one is actually the ICO. Um, that's where I draw the line, um, liner and they're both in black. All right, choose which one. Hey, look, there's two of them, two. All right, juice, you want this one? Okay. So we are going to just do a plain Jane eyeliner look. Thank you, sweet boy. He's like, okay, my services are done. I am walking away now. So now that the eyeliner is finished and is on, um, the next step usually is lashes, but I only have one lashes to choose from. So I'm going to just go ahead and apply these and I will be right back. Okay, so while I wait for lashes to dry, I'm just going to take um, another shade from the James Charles palette and pop into the inner corner. So I'm going to take this pinkish shade and just pop that right into the inner corner just to highlight it and bring some attention to it and then bam that is done so the next step is mascara and today we'll be choosing between, sorry, let me put this to the side. Um, where'd you come from? Man. 
Okay, so today we'll be choosing between the Benefit Bad Gal Bang Mascara and the Maybelline Total Temptations Waterproof Mascara. So both of these are great. The only con I have against this one is it's scented, so it gives me a bad, bad, bad headache when I put it onto my eyelashes. Don't know why, I've never figured it out, but it's okay because this makeup is coming off here shortly. Um, but these are the two choices for today. All right, Drake. So which one? Hold on, you have to see both. Okay, now which one you want? Uh, I know you did not just diss me. Okay, you want this one? Okay, so he chose the Benefit Bad Gal Bang Mascara. You want this one for fun? Okay, good boy. Thank you. And there he goes again. He's like, Mom, if you don't need my services, I'm just gonna leave. So I'm just going to set face right now and I'm just going to be using the Max Prep and Prime. Because oh, I have so much powder on. Okay, she's okay. I have so much powder on my face right now I just need it to set and I'm about to do blush. So we're going to see. Okay, so the choice is this blush and this palette, or I have a new cream brush and the blush, not brush, and this is the blush serum. This is probably gonna turn this look so terrible if he chooses this one, but it's okay, because we'll make it work, right? Right. All right, so let me see which one he wants me to use. All right. So you see, which one? Wow. All right, thank you. I have to make this work now. All right, your services are done for right now. I'll call you back in a second. Thank you. Go. Or stay right there. Okay. So, this is what this looks like. It's really peachy. So, we're going to see. I'm just going to take a little bit. And just <laughs> wonderful. And let's just tap that in. just dab over that because you know it's a cream yes it needs to be set oh my god <laughs> what did he do to me all right it'll be good all right so for highlight i only have one highlight so i'm just going to go ahead and highlight and he looks pretty comfy on the ground too so i don't want to mess him up just gonna highlight my face with this highlighter So blam, pow, okay. Now that we have our highlight and our terrible blush done, that highlight, oh, whew. under this light, she blunt. 
Let's back up a little bit. All right, so now that I have that done, I'm just going to highlight the brow bones because I forgot to do that. Um, yep, yeah, finger. That's good. They need some love too. And lip. We're just going to set that one more time. Let it just sink in. And then we have three choices for the lip today. We can go with the belt lipstick in the bright red, the CoverGirl lipstick in the nude. So I'll just show you. That's the CoverGirl lipstick. This is the Belk lipstick. And then this is the Fight Beauty in the shade Grace. Grace Glace. Well, they're about the same. Whatever. It'll work. So honestly, since these two are about the same, I'm just going to throw the cover girl out and we're going to choose between these two. Alright. Which one? Which one? Which one? Oh, we're going red. I really wanted to try this one. Here, thank you for participating. Can you tell them you love them? No, you're eating right now. You don't want to say anything? Okay. Let mom put lipstick on and we'll take a picture, okay? Let me put lipstick on. Uh, can can I do this in private? Thank you. No, this this is not this is not a treat. I need to put lipstick on. Thank you. Hey guys so this is the you see the trick in my hand this is how I'm getting him to sit up here hey do I have lipstick on my teeth no okay so this all right hey you lied I did have lipstick on my teeth you say sorry okay hey treat um thank you guys for watching today I hope you all enjoyed it I hope you enjoyed the masterpiece that my wonderful why did we choose lipstick like this why you don't know okay guys this is the final look and i'm just going to finish it off with the morphe set and mist spray Ooh, smells good don't it yeah okay um, i hope you enjoyed this video i hope that he wants a treat bad okay other than that, we hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a massive thumbs up. He was such a trooper. Um, comment down below what you would like to see next. And um, if you are new here and you waited this far and you've seen everything, you might as well just go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. There's a bell right beside it. It does notify you every time that I post a video onto my channel. And I guess until next time, may God bless you all. He's looking for this treat. You enjoyed it? Oh, enjoyed it? Sweet boy. Okay, bye.